Look guys, MacBooks are a serious investment and they need to be protected at all costs. So it's not like you buy one MacBook and you're all set. No, 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 no. You've got to buy a bunch of different accessories to truly up your MacBook game. And that is what I'm going to tell you in today's video. So welcome geeks. My name is Lakshay. You're watching iGeeks vlog and let's get started with today's video. The number one accessory you have got to buy is a good dock. Now the thing is, if you are a proud owner of a MacBook from 2016 with an Intel chip or a 2021 MacBook Pro with well an M1 Max chip, you still don't have enough ports. I know, I'm facing the same problem which is why you should buy a great dock. And this one is an 8-in-2 dock from Anchor, not 8-in-1, an 8-in-2 because it goes into both the USB-C ports on the side of your MacBook Pro. It's got a lot of ports and is really effective. I'm gonna list the number of ports you get. So you get one multifunction USB-C port, one USB-C data port, two USB-A ports, one HDMI port, one SD card slot, one micro SD card slot, as well as a lightning audio port. So if you've got earphones that go into your iPhone, you can plug these with your MacBook as well by using this dock from Anchor. This dock also supports charging speeds of up to 100 watts. You also get data transfer speeds of up to 40 gigabytes per second, and it supports 5K media display output as well. And the best part, it costs just $70, you do not have to splurge on any other thing. Next category is an external storage. Now you can never have too much storage and if you buy the storage tiers from Apple, they are really expensive, right? Buying an external storage or an external hard drive or an external SSD is always more economical. Which is why I have got the perfect recommendation for you and this is the SanDisk Ultra Portable 1TB SSD. You can also get up to 1050 megabytes of read speeds and up to 1000 megabytes of writing speeds with this SSD. It's amazing, it's incredibly fast. You also get drop protection of up to 2 meters, so if you accidentally drop this one, it's not going to damage any of your data. It's IP55 water and dust resistant, so it's definitely much more stronger than any of those SSDs you find on the market and you know what? It's got a great deal going on right now and it sells for just $139. So hurry on, buy it before the stocks go away. Category number three is a charging station. Now Apple's MacBooks are known to have great, amazing, incredible battery life. They've set the industry standard for the battery life in a laptop. But then again, they do need to be plugged in eventually, right? You can't just not charge your MacBook, that's just no good. So once you do start to plug it in, then you're gonna add an extra adapter to your desk. Maybe you're reaching for a power strip or just adding to that clutter on your desk. Nobody likes that, which is why you should invest in a good charging station. And this charging station by Anchor is a 4-in-1 USB-C charging station and it's perfect for your needs. It supports a power output of 120 watts. Now that is a staggering figure. You can charge two laptops and two smartphones because you've got four USB-C ports and one is a 100 watt USB-C port, the other is a 60 watt USB-C port. These are both for laptops and for smartphones you get two ports of 20 watts USB-C each. So all of your devices will be covered by just one charging station. And since this is Anchor, then you know it's going to be good. It costs $120 and I would bet my life savings on it to tell you that it is really good and you're gonna love it. While you're too busy checking out these products on Amazon, in the meantime, don't forget to subscribe to iGeeks Blog and turn on all our notifications. Next up, let's talk about a wireless mouse. Now, I know what you're thinking. Hey, MacBook touchpads are really good, right? Well, they are. They're huge, they're responsive, but then again, if you're a programmer, if you're a graphic designer, if you're a coder, then you do need an external mouse because the MacBook touchpad, it ain't gonna cut it, right? You need something extra. And for that very reason, I'm recommending this Logitech MX Master 3 Edition. You get six buttons in this mouse. You get up to 4,000 DPI. Now, if you are a mouse user, then you know what I'm talking about, right? 4,000 DPI is massive. It's great for programmers, it's great for coders, great for video editors, graphic designers, you name it. If you want a wireless mouse, this is the one to get. It's got a great design, amazing battery life, and when you click it, the buttons feel amazing, incredible. But my favorite thing has to be that it is so customizable, which is why the reason I'm recommending it to all of you. And that is that you can create custom profiles for every specific app that you use. 
For example, say you're editing something in Photoshop, you can create a profile for Photoshop so your buttons behave in a different way. And when you're back to editing in Final Cut Pro, then you can create, you can switch to your FCP profile, which means your controls are now set to FCP. So you don't have to go back and forth and switch the controls every time you switch between the two apps. This is incredible. The amount of customization you get here is not possible anywhere else, which is why this is my top recommendation. Oh, and did I tell you it only costs $100? Now that is incredible value for me. You're getting a lot of product here for not a lot of money. Now my next category is privacy. Now I know what you're thinking. Well, privacy for a MacBook isn't that built in? Well, it is. Apple does a lot of that. But then again, Apple cannot protect your MacBook screens from prying eyes from people who lurk behind your shoulder and look into your MacBook and see what you're doing when you're in a cafe or on a plane or any other public space. We all use our MacBooks there, right? But then we can't stop these people from looking into our screens. And sometimes we feel pretty uneasy that somebody is just, you know, there looking into our screens. If you want to stop that, then you've got to get this amazing accessory that I'm about to show you. This is the Sight Pro Magnetic Privacy Screen. Now, this is what you need. It is a magnetically attaching screen protector, sort of. You can fit it, you can attach it to your MacBook screens and nobody can see what is going on in your MacBook. And when I say nobody, I mean everyone else. You of course can see it. So if you're looking at it front on, head on, you can actually see the screen. But if somebody is trying to see from the side and you know they're trying to peer into your screen, they're trying to see what you're doing, they will not be able to see what is going on on your screen. So this is amazing. And the best part is it's not like those protectors that you get for your iPhones where, you know, you just have to attach it once. And if you remove it, it won't go back on. No, this, there is no adhesive involved. This is magnetic. So you can attach it, reattach it, remove it whenever you want. The only issue here is it kind of dims the screen down. It re reduces the brightness of your MacBook display. But then again, that's a small price to pay for a whole lot of privacy. So of course, the link is going to be there in the description. It costs $35 by the way. But the thing is, this link is for the 13 inch MacBook. But don't worry, every other MacBook size you can think of, these people have got your screen protector for you. So just head on to the link, explore different sizes, and get the one you need. Next category is earphones and well, there's no other place to look. You should get AirPods Pro. They cost about $175. I'm not going to speak too much about AirPods Pro because you already know what they are. Great design, amazing sound. They also work with your MacBook. They're not just for your iPhones. $175. Link is going to be in the description. Category number seven is a case. Nobody likes getting scratches on their MacBook, period which is why you should invest in a good case. Skins, they look good, but cases, they really protect your MacBook. Even if you accidentally drop it, cases are shockproof. They provide you drop protection as well. And that is why you should get the in-case hard shell case. This is great for MacBook. It's got rubberized feet, so the MacBook does not skid on a surface. It's got great ventilation for your MacBook, so it keeps it cool. And obviously, it's got great access to all your ports, lights, and everything else that you can think of. $50 is the price. Link is in the description. Do not forget to check it out. So that was it. Those are the best accessories you need to get for your MacBook right away. Do not worry, guys. I've been saying it so many times. All of these links are going to be in the description. If you do buy anything from us, do let us know in the comments down below. We're waiting to hear your feedback on how you find these products to be. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one.